the recent undertaking of unloading and transporting two massive transformers, one weighing 278 tons and the other 351 tons, from a barge to a designated substation site in Hamburg was an extraordinary engineering operation. This complex project required specialized equipment, meticulous planning, and the expertise of top logistics teams, including Franz Brocht KG and Karl Schwerlast, both of which are renowned in the field of heavy transport and lifting. Using the powerful CC3800 Superlift Crawler Crane and Karl Schwerlast's sophisticated self-propelled modular transporters, SPMTs, each step was executed with high precision to ensure safety and efficiency. This operation highlights the impressive logistical and engineering challenges involved when handling cargo of such considerable size and weight. The transformers, which are essential components for managing and distributing electrical power in Hamburg, needed to be handled with great care and accuracy, as even minor issues could jeopardize the entire operation. Before any physical work could commence, an exhaustive planning phase was crucial to identify all necessary resources, technical requirements and potential challenges. Both the 278-ton and 351-ton transformers were being transported from their manufacturing facility to a substation in Hamburg as part of a broader power grid modernization project. The transformers' significant weight and size meant that traditional road transport would be unfeasible for the entire journey. Instead, transporting them by barge provided a safer and more direct route, bypassing potential road infrastructure limitations and allowing for easier access to Hamburg's docking facilities. This choice was the initial step in mitigating risks associated with moving such heavy loads, but it required additional planning to ensure a seamless transition from water transport to ground handling and placement. The selection of the CC3800 Superlift Crawler Crane was a strategic decision based on its capacity and capabilities. Known for its lifting power, versatility, and advanced stability features, the CC3800 is among the few cranes capable of handling loads in excess of 600 tons making it ideal for a task of this magnitude. The crane's design features a robust crawler base that helps distribute its immense weight across a broader surface area, minimizing ground pressure and providing stability even when performing lifts near its upper weight capacity. Furthermore, its superlift attachment provides additional counterweight, which is essential for managing the high center of gravity that comes with lifting such heavy equipment. Given that both transformers exceeded typical load weights, the superlift functionality allowed operators to conduct lifts safely while reducing the risk of imbalance or structural strain. Franz Brocht KG, with its extensive experience in operating heavy lifting equipment, mobilized a skilled team of engineers, crane operators, and rigging specialists to handle this operation. Each team member was assigned specific roles and responsibilities ensuring that all stages of the operation would be executed seamlessly. The planning stage involved analyzing variables such as dock conditions, potential weather fluctuations, and the barge's stability to ensure a stable lifting environment. Calculations accounted for any anticipated water currents, wind speeds, and potential movement on the barge. This level of planning was critical as both the crane and the barge needed to remain perfectly balanced to avoid accidents or damage to the valuable equipment.
The first physical step in the operation involved positioning both the CC-3800 crane and the barge carrying the transformers. This process demanded millimeter-level precision, as even slight misalignments could have severe consequences when handling loads as heavy as these transformers. The barge was carefully maneuvered into a docking position that offered both stability and accessibility for the crane. The docking area had been pre-assessed and prepared for the operation, with temporary reinforcements added to ensure it could handle the combined weight of the barge, crane, and transformers. With the barge securely in place, the CC-3800 crane was assembled and configured at the site. The assembly process for such a crane is extensive, often requiring several days, as each component must be correctly aligned and secured to ensure structural integrity. After assembly, the crane was outfitted with its superlift attachment to maximize its lifting capacity and stability. The crane's operators conducted a series of tests, carefully calibrating the equipment to match the exact weight and dimensions of the transformers. Load sensors were integrated into the rigging setup, providing real-time data on weight distribution, which was essential for identifying any issues before the actual lift began. Rigging the transformers for the lift was a critical stage that demanded high precision and strict adherence to safety protocols. The transformers had specific lifting points designed to support their substantial weight during hoisting. Rigging specialists from Franz Brock KG examined these points carefully to determine the most secure way to attach the crane's hooks and cables. Given the heavy nature of the transformers, the rigging process involved multiple high-strength cables and hooks, each rated to withstand loads well beyond the weight of the transformers, to provide a safety margin. Advanced load sensors were attached to the rigging setup, allowing the operators to monitor the weight distribution in real time. These sensors were connected to a central monitoring system that alerted the team to any discrepancies in load balance, enabling them to make immediate adjustments if necessary. During the lift, any sudden shifts or imbalances could lead to catastrophic results, so these precautions were essential in maintaining the stability of both the crane and the load. The team performed multiple checks on each hook and cable, verifying that they were secured and aligned properly to handle the heavy load. With the rigging in place, the crane operators began the lifting process for the 278-ton transformer. The initial phase involved raising the transformer just a few centimeters off the barge to test the balance and confirm that the load was stable. This brake lift technique is a standard safety measure in heavy lifting operations, allowing the team to make last-minute adjustments before the full lift. Once stability was confirmed, the crane lifted the transformer to a designated height, moving it slowly and carefully to minimize swaying. As the crane swung the transformer away from the barge, Carl Schwerlast's team positioned the self-propelled modular transporters, SPMTs, beneath it. These SPMTs, equipped with multiple heavy-duty axles, 
provided the necessary support for the transformer's considerable weight. Carl Schwerlast's expertise in heavy transport was evident in their precise positioning of the SPMTs, ensuring they could bear the transformer's weight without risking damage to the axles or the transformer bridge. The transformer bridge, a reinforced platform on the SPMTs, allowed for even weight distribution, which was crucial for safe transport. After the transformer was securely lowered onto the SPMTs, Carl Schwerlast's team conducted a final round of inspections to verify that the load was balanced and stable. Each axle on the SPMTs was calibrated to respond to the weight, ensuring that the transporters could move smoothly and efficiently. This stage of the operation required constant communication between the crane operators, the SPMT controllers, and the ground crew, who monitored the load from multiple angles to confirm its stability. With the 278-ton transformer secured on the SPMTs, the team proceeded to transport it to its designated location within the substation. This stage involved navigating through a series of turns, narrow pathways, and areas with limited clearance. Call Schwerlast's SPMTs are specifically designed for such challenges, as they offer precise control over each axle allowing for minute adjustments to avoid obstacles and maneuver through tight spaces. The transport route had been carefully mapped out in advance, with ground crews positioned at key points to guide the SPMT operators. Each section of the route was reinforced as needed to prevent ground compression and ensure that the heavy load would not cause damage to the underlying surface. In areas with particularly tight clearance, the operators used the SBMIT's multi-directional steering capabilities to inch the transformer forward, making adjustments as necessary to avoid any potential obstructions. Once the SPMTs reached the installation site, the team began the delicate process of positioning the transformer for placement. Ground personnel used radio communication and hand signals to guide the SPMT operators providing precise instructions to ensure that the transformer was aligned with the receiving platform. This platform had been reinforced to handle the transformer's weight, with heavy-duty mounts and anchor points in place to secure it permanently. The crane then released the load, and final checks were conducted to ensure the transformer was seated correctly. Call Schwerlast's team secured it using specialized mounts designed to prevent any shifting or movement once in place, this final placement marked the successful completion of the 278-ton transformer's journey from the barge to its operational position. The unloading and transportation of the 351-ton transformer followed a similar process but required additional adjustments to account for the increased weight. The team at Franz Brockt KG and Karl Schwerlast had gained valuable insights from handling the first transformer, 
enabling them to refine their approach for the second lift. The 351-ton transformer posed greater demands on the crane's lifting capacity, and additional counterweights were attached to the CC3800 to enhance stability. The rigging and lifting process for the 351-ton transformer involved slight modifications to the hook and cable arrangements. Taking into consideration the different dimensions and weight distribution of this heavier unit, the crane's superlift function was essential for managing this load, as it provided the extra balance needed to maintain stability during the lift. Call Schwerlast also made adjustments to the SPMTs, reconfiguring the axle setup and transformer bridge to handle the additional weight safely. Once the crane lifted the 351-ton transformer, the SPMTs were again positioned to receive it. The same meticulous care was taken during this phase to prevent any imbalance or shift in the load, with real-time data monitoring used to track weight distribution. After the transformer was lowered onto the SPMTs, Call Schwerlast's team undertook the transportation phase, navigating the larger and heavier unit along the pre-established route to its designated position within the substation. The successful placement of both transformers marked a significant achievement for the teams involved. These transformers will play a crucial role in Hamburg's power grid, enabling the substation to handle higher electricity demands and improve the reliability of the city's energy distribution. The success of this project underscores the importance of collaboration, planning, and specialized equipment in large-scale heavy lifting and transport operations. Throughout this project, the teams adhered to stringent safety protocols, with contingency plans ready to address any unexpected issues. The partnership between Franz Brocht KG and Karl Schwerlast exemplifies the level of expertise and attention to detail required in handling complex industrial logistics. The successful completion of this operation not only highlights the capabilities of modern heavy lifting technology, but also the skill and precision of the teams who make such projects possible.